this bony protection around the eye can vary and it was slowly increased through primate lineages. So for example, you can see in this lemur, there is a post-orbital bar, but there is no bony protection behind the eye. It is open behind the uh, eye. There is no bony socket. In this prosimian, the tarsier, notice that there is bony protection behind the eye. It is not complete. There's not a complete bony socket, but it is certainly more bony protection than found in the lemur. For that reason, it is thought that tarsiers represent a branch of prosimians which are more closely related to uh, the higher primates of monkeys and apes than the lemurs are. Finally, you can see here in this New World monkey, there is a complete bony socket behind the eye. And so we can see gradual stages in the amount of bony protection around the eye, with the first primates possessing a post-orbital bar, but little else. Other prosimians possessing uh, more bony protection behind the eye. And thus, in the anthropoid primates, a complete bony socket, and we can see that vision was becoming more important in the higher primates, thus uh, explaining the greater bony protection for the eye.